Okay, okay, that works. Does the shit don't stink? Where's the power? Uh, looks like you should be alright soon. Yeah, you feel right. better. Um, I'll go ahead. Yeah, you know, just let the nurses know that you want to uh, be released, and they will get all the paperwork handled for you. Um, okay. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and disconnect all the IVs. I would recommend though you take at least uh, at least one aspirin a couple days because right now there is an anesthetic on your wound and it's gonna start to hurt if you need something stronger. If you to come here in contact with them, we to have this situation with some pain medication. Okay, okay. I uh I wonder one thing. Instead of uh, narcotics, could I get like a prescription on like medical marijuana? I just, I just don't like the narcotics, you know. Oh, I fully understand. Yeah, that, that's why I don't just go ahead and just start throwing them at people. But right, right. Um, yeah, no problem. Come check with us at the uh, front desk uh, when you're on your way out, and I'll see what I can do. I, I, I don't make any promises. Can you see it up there? Okay, all right. Hi, could I get a patch up, please? All right. I took Thank a you. header off of a building again. It seems to be my thing. Okay, thank you. Uh, thank you very much for that. You be safe out there. Hey, man. My West Spring police. Um. So are you? Oh, well, sir. Hello. How we doing? How you feeling? I'm feeling better. It, it's not burning anymore, so. That's good. That's good. Yeah. Um, at the... Hello? Yeah, yeah. Okay, sorry, you kind of... Uh, okay, I'm kind of seeing shit, so... Um, well, whenever you're ready, man. I'm not gonna rush you. Um, I'm gonna... Go ahead and place you under arrest. Um... I'm gonna Mirandize you right now as well. You do have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do will be used against you in the court of law. You have a right to an attorney if you can't afford one will be provided by the state if available. Understand these rights? Yes. Okay, and would you like a lawyer, by the way? Um, I... I, I think I may. I don't know. I, I'll have to, uh... Sure. Hear what you have to say. Yeah, sure. Um. Hey, let me get a chance to be my... Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. Um, if you give me a sec, uh, Mr. Power, I'll be right with you, okay? Okay, okay. Mr. Your friend, Mr. Jefferson, is going to be staying in ICU for the night. Okay. All right. Is he? Well, is he going to be okay? Oh yeah, he's okay. Okay. So, uh, I guess he wants to just rest over for, for the night. Okay. Um, okay. So, so the thing is, is that, uh, you know, you were members. So what happened was I had a major downland growth. I uh, responded to a scene down there, right? Um, he found some stuff, he found some evidence, um, regarding uh, casings and such, and he wanted to talk with, you know, T. Uh, <coughs> they tried talking, uh, T then decided to, you know, they had a back and forth, which then you and Mr. Jefferson were part of shooting at three officers. But, yes, three officers. Um, Previously, you had surrounded one officer before, but then more backup showed up, and then it turned into a shootout that you were involved with. Um, and that's what happened to you. You kind of got involved in the shootout, and you were, you know, apprehended. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, and you did shoot at officers, so, um, you know, I'll talk to your lawyer. Uh, yeah, about yeah. Your charges, okay? Uh, yeah, I think, I, I think that'll be best. Sure, yeah. Um... Juniper, the other individual, Mr. Jefferson, is going to be staying at ICU for tonight. Um, I'll go ahead and write a warrant for him. Um, 
that's what we're going to do yet. We'll have to watch we'll out of warrant. Um, now that's sad. If you hear us and your friend wakes up, just because he's a warrant doesn't mean we're going to hunt him down. If he wants to turn himself in and deal with what happened or not, with the warrant is just so whoever picks him up knows what to charge him for, okay? Okay, alright. Um, all actually, right. let me go run into Cop 10 real quick to personally ID. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll let him know. I hope he's all right. Well, and we're not, we don't want to deal with the legal ass uh, ramifications to what he did until we make sure he's medically sound, all right? Yeah, yeah, I so, hear that. for what it's worth, I hope that he pulls through as well, because I pulled a gun and I shot at you guys to defend my troopers and myself tonight. And that's not something that I do lightly. Yeah, so yeah. I want you to understand that I, I, I wish that you and your, your friend are up and about moving around real soon, okay? Okay, I appreciate it. Alright, as soon as you're feeling good enough to go, we'll get you down on uh, MRPD to get you by, okay? Yeah, I think, I think I'm good. It's it's sore. They, they said they might be able to, like, I don't like the narcotics, and they said they might be able to give me a prescription on, on medical marijuana if we stop at the front desk. That would help. Um, also, there's some... Um, non-narcotic painkillers you can use is called tramadol it's a schedule 2 narcotic so it's not as powerful as like a i think he's already asleep it's like back in your morphine or anything okay okay i i just don't like the pills i've seen too many too many people go down fair enough um rizzo he wants to stop by the front desk to see if he can get a prescription for medical marijuana and um in place of painkillers so uh, uh this is good to me sure okay um let me help you off the bed, all right? Am I uncuffed? I, I can't uh, feel that arm. Okay, there cool, cool. Right, let me help you off. Still got a bit of a, a numbing from that surgery. I got yeah, you. They're gonna, um, yeah, they probably put a local lip stick in there so you don't feel that. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put cuffs on you and I'm gonna loosen the cuffs for you, okay? Okay, all right. Let's walk over to the front desk. Uh, he he has been Miranda's cab. Okay, good. This is just for our protection. Don't worry about this one. Meaning ours and yours, being that you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They all come aboard and turn belly. Hey, Rizzo! Hi, Ryder. Hey. Hi. Uh, Doctor, are you able to write prescription? Uh, 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 not too bad, how are you? I've been better. I don't know. Why do you have a hole in your chest? Okay. So, um, what we'll do is we will follow up with the prescription to you. Okay. okay. Or right. when, you, when you finish, when you finish the bubble break, you can come back and probably get a prescription. Okay, okay. Uh, be this, the doctor, the doctor doesn't have a prescription at all. Gotcha, right. gotcha. I did put a note in your file that you uh, were requesting rather than narcotics. So, if so someone, someone looks at your records, they'll know. Mm. Okay, I appreciate it. Thank so you. If you prefer that, if you prefer that to go up to the pills, then uh, because we'll uh, either we could probably get that prescription filled for you up the phone book, or you could come back. Fine. Fine. I mean, like, okay, okay. okay. Wait, where did, where oh, did, where Jesus did, Christ. What is happening? That, that person's that's just that's hitting person. every single car. In that fucking piss washer truck. Is a, a penis. Car. A very really big fuck slap in the face. Hold on, hold on, get a second. In the car. Uh, drop oh, tap. Okay. Yes, please. Oh, sorry. No, you're good. Just to get yourself in. Get your buckle in. Six digits. Okay. Nine, four. Is this the only 95 player that you have from? Uh, the other one Thank is you. staying the night, and I see you have to write a warrant. Alright. Alright, let me see if I can get you flipped. Uh, okay. up there, as well. civilian, please. Uh, they're, they're gonna try to flip me. Okay. Will we process admission row or VPD? Uh, we'll process admission row. I'll let them do it. Alright. Command 1 is 76 to admission row. There they go. There they go. Okay. Oh, good. They got I'd rather not ram a car with a. Okay, okay. Put your head, 
Alright, alright. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, yeah, I'd like to talk to him. Yeah, well, I do know that uh, people like the uh, the sensation of the power of a gun, but thankfully, I was wearing my vest tonight, or else uh, I wouldn't be standing here. Yeah, yeah. Hello. Hi. How you doing? Hi. Good. My name's Sky. This is Ash. Uh, we'll be representing you today. Okay. Alright. Yeah, sure. I, I, I told you you received medical attention. Do you need any food or drink? No, no, no. I'm good. They they took care of me pretty well. Alright. So, yeah. Yeah, Sky so, down. Just two counts of assault. Yeah, that's that's what they that's what they got me. But I mean, their story, my story, are a little different, you know. They, All right. They, it's yours. They uh they start shooting at my at my homeboy, and I mean I I can't just let them start shooting at my homeboy. All he was all he was doing was sitting on the block talking to him. I mean, the, how how's the conversation ratchet up to to gunshots like that? I don't think it's right. Can you start from square one? Why were the police uh, there yeah. at all? So I guess they were down there. Yeah, tell us the entire story. Okay, okay. Yeah, I, I had went down to Cluckett Bell, and when I got back, done eating, I come out, and there's a guy, a cop, he's uh, searching the block, you know, that little roundabout there. And, uh, you know, he comes up, and we're, we're all standing there, and he said he's, he's investigating something that happened. I don't know, he said he found a bullet casing. And then uh, he wanted uh, T to come off the roof, and you know, T wouldn't. I mean, we weren't we weren't even around. And then, then he just starts shooting at him. So, you know, I did what I had to do. I'm not sure. No, uh, that's another dude. That's a uh, DJ. He's uh, he's an ICU. Okay. All right. Um, they're just trying to push assault, right? Hey, yes, just two counts of assault. Two because it was an officer. Yeah. Sorry, I'm I'm learning. Oh, you're fine. You're fine. I appreciate you guys. You guys helped me out. Yeah, no problem. Well, what would you like to see happen? I know you think it's bullshit and it was self defense, obviously. But what would you like to see? Best case scenario. I mean, besides walking free, obviously. Well, I mean. uh... I, I don't know. I, I I mean, two assault charges is. I mean, two two is See, pretty pretty crazy. Yeah. One, yeah, yeah. I could I could live with that. Uh, I still think it's wrong, but. It's only two because it's one. It's technically one account assault, but since it's a a police officer or if it's not, it's it's with like police officers. E EMS, paramedics, all that, since they're uh, public workers, it pops it up to two counts. Gotcha, gotcha. Luckily, 
and like it's the same thing like if you did something on at, on like MRPD property it would double again okay so what what's the min and max I guess then can we can we like push for the minimum I mean I, I get that it was you know police officer. I know I just can't like get it brushed under the rug I, I get that aim for more time or more fine and oh yeah for it. sure it's, it's two assaults is that active i don't think they said it's aggravated they just said assault so no, they didn't say aggravated so it's just 20 and 4. so would you rather more finer time <coughs> uh, because we can push for either regardless of tell you the truth they uh yeah I, I don't have a lot. I don't want to be paying it off. So I guess I guess so, do what you can with time, and you know, okay. and uh, try to keep the fine down, even if I gotta serve a little bit more. Yeah. Okay. That's good to know. All right. Yep. Okay. You good? That's it. Yep. Yep. All right. Thank you, guys. No problem. Yep. Just an assault. Be, yeah, it'll be assault. Uh, so, in the penal code, we have three different assault charges. Simple assault, assault, and aggravated assault. Tonight, uh, we are going with two counts of assault. Not simple, not aggravated, just assault. And then that's uh, 20 and 4. 20 and 4 and a half? 20 and 4. 20 and 4. 20 and 4, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So would you like to make an offer for your client? Uh, about 15 and 2. Okay, so you're doing the process. You're doing about 15 and 2. Well, it was a mess down there, but... He has been quite uh, compliant since we brought him in. I wasn't mm -hmm. uh, I'll tell you what, I will... Yeah, I like to do the two sounds good. The true behaviors. Mm -hmm. Yep, I'm okay. I agree. That's fine with me. Yep, absolutely. Uh, and will I guess my, I guess my question is: Will you probably once the other comes out of ICU? Well, I guess it's up to him if he needs yeah. legal assistance. Right. Yeah, we'll have yeah. a we'll, we'll have a warrant ready for him. Uh, so when he wakes up at ICU, which we desperately hope he does soon, as we all soon. Um, I believe the docs have been keeping him overnight. Um, but yes, then we will warrant him about attorney stuff in, or if you wish to contact the Lord to negotiate for him, we'll do it that way. Alright. Uh, however, for your client here, I'll let you cast the due process. Yep. Alright, um, so are you going to be seeking, uh, legal aid? Fine, name though. Uh, be seeking legal aid. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what's your name, sir? Uh, Nick Stanley. Uh, Scotty. Scotty McStanley, you said? Uh, yes. Yeah. Alright. Okay.
15 months, 2000. All right. 825 Bolingbroke Transport. You'll be receiving Mr. Zach Power. He's going to be staying with you for 15 months. He's wearing blue jeans, a purple plaid top, and a purple hat. Take good care of him. See you soon, buddy. Take care of yourself in there. We'll see you when you get out, all right? Yep, yep. Thank you. Thank you, Scotty. And no thank problem. you, too. I'm bad with names, but thank you as well. Uh, Ash. Ash. Thank you, too. <laughs>